I'm David Brumley. I'm a professor here at Carnegie Mellon. I'm also the director of Scilab, the Carnegie Mellon Security and Privacy Institute. I work in the area of software security. My research looks at how we can make the world software safe. So many people think things like antivirus will keep them safe from the bad guys. But really all antivirus does is detect when the bad guys are already on your computer. We want to make it so they're never there. And the way we do this is we look at the software that you're using and we look for security vulnerabilities. We try to find them and we try to fix them automatically. For someone to trust their computer, they have to know that it's safe. They have to know that no one's on it. And so everyone, of course, is worried about attackers breaking into their system. And so our work really like, looks to make computers as safe as the airplanes that we ride on or the cars that we use. Unfortunately, computer security is a pretty new field, and so there's this huge demand for computer security professionals that can't be filled. And so I spend a lot of my time doing outreach to try to build up that field. And as part of that, we do activities such as running Pico CTF, a high school hacking competition where every year we get about 10,000 high school kids to participate and we give away $50,000 in scholarship. It's actually the largest by number of people playing and prize pool in the world. The other thing that I do is I run a CMU hacking team. And so many people think like hacking is a bad thing. It's really a skill. It's a skill of going and finding the security problems that an attacker would use and being able to fix them before they do. And so there's competitions on how well you can do this. And we compete against the world's best. And CMU, I'm proud to say, has actually been ranked number one the last few years in the world. In fact, we've won what's widely considered the Super Bowl of hacking called DEF CON the last two years. So our work is already starting to show some fruit. Currently, one of the most popular systems people use is called Linux. It's what really powers the world's computers. And so far, we've found 13,000 unknown vulnerabilities. 13,000. We're looking to go and take those vulnerabilities and automatically protect against them. So a lot of the research you're seeing today is already paying off. When it comes down to computer security, really, what you want to talk about is how safe the software is running on your computer. We want to make it safer, and we want to make it so that everyone can check the security of their software.